Today, I can proudly say that we have a complete range of uh, implant portfolio which we are distributing across the globe. Uh, the recent uh, MISO robotic system which we have launched, it's already AI enabled. So AI makes it more information quicker, faster. It's a kind of a fully automatic uh, robo where all the bone cuts are done with the help of a robo. Uh, the surgeon, the patient, the implant, the technique and the technology, all these put together definitely has proven in better patient outcomes and that's why our tagline says metal more to life. I am uh, Vivek Shah, associated with Merrill for more than 15 years now. It has been a great journey right from beginning uh, in the year 2009. That's the time when we started our orthopedic business. Yeah, my name is Manish Deshmukh and I'm the Chief Marketing Officer at Merrill Healthcare Private Limited. My journey with uh, Merrill began way back in 2011. So it's more than 13 years now. At Merrill has become a, always a front runner in uh, innovating the newer products. Uh, we can say today, I think in India, we are market leader. We are having a more than 42% market share in the country. We started at a stage where we wanted to educate our own uh, surgeons at the same time patients that here we have an implant which has a sizing which suits best to almost the world population. We always believe that that awareness uh, in the patient community about uh, uh, the arthritis and the solution for the arthritis should be conveyed to them and they should be uh, convinced about that if I am getting this therapy, I am going to be treated fully, I will be much happier, I can live healthy life and that's what is our, uh, our commitment to the industry that we will always try to support the HCP's healthcare professionals across the globe. I can proudly say that we have a complete range of uh, implant portfolio, right from uh, the knees and hips, revision knee, revision hip, uh, the unicorn dialer, uncemented, and now the latest technology when, when we talk about uh, the robotics and AI, we have got everything available. As far as trauma is concerned, yes, we, we also have uh, almost 90% portfolio which is complete. Robot for trauma application will be ready, hopefully within next uh, five to six months time as well. We started making uh, high performance implants to begin with. The Freedom Knee by itself, the design, it has got dynamic sizing ratios which suits the global population. That's where we started. We added a flavor to it by getting a TINBN coating as a technology. We made that popular. It, is, uh, it has got a high performance. We've introduced vitamin E poly inserts. So these are some of the technologies which will give us a long lasting implants. When it came to implantation as a technique via a technology, we thought navigation was little old and it is phasing out across the globe. So that's where we introduced robotics. In India as such, we are market leaders when it comes to robotics in replacement surgeries. Additionally, what we thought is uh, Robo is a very capital intensive item. That's where we introduced AR as a technology. Augmented reality made a very good understanding with the surgeons how it works and it pro provides additional information to surgeons. And we've uh, just began manufacturing 3D printed, uncemented knee implants. And we are also venturing into 3D printed hip implants to make. So these are uh, some of the technologies that we introduced. By taking a timely treatment on uh, osteoarthritis, it will reduce the overall pain. The life becomes much uh, happier, healthier, and uh, you regain your mobility as early as possible. So it is very important to treat it on time. 
the recent uh, MISO robotic system which we have launched. It's already AI enabled and uh, we've gathered historic data and we have integrated it so well that as an example, uh, when you are doing image-based uh, robotic uh, surgery, we get a patient CT done from the uh, hip center to the talus and the hip images uh, are then transferred to the planning station. Now there's a process called uh, uh, segmentation. The segmentation normally would take about 35 to 40 minutes while if we are using AI, which is what we are doing, this 40 minutes thing is done in five minutes flat. We say less than five minutes, we guarantee. Now that said, there's a thing called, you know, providing a prompt while the planning of the surgery is being done. So every time the surgeon has to pick up a point, he is looking at the planning station. They say, hey, here is the point. Can you just click there and check if you are right? So those prompts are also all AI generated. So AI makes it more information quicker, faster. It gives the right directions and prompts for the surgeon to proceed in the, in the way it should uh, get navigated. So that's a main uh, advantage. Mm -hmm.